Hey guys, Shadow here. Welcome back to another Gears of War 5 video. Today we are going to be discussing will Kate Diaz become evil, taking her place as the new Locust Queen in Gears 5. During the Gears 5 gameplay reveal, we learned that Kate Diaz has been experiencing a lot of nightmares over the last few months prior to the game beginning, involving her connection to Queen Mira and both the Locust and the Swarm, causing her to question her existence as her world is turned upside down by firstly losing her mother, Reina Diaz, back at the Swarm hive in the previous game to now as we speculated in the previous video the mysterious unanswered death of Oscar Diaz 2. With these nightmares being what seems a mixture of past memories and present moments it's having a huge toll on Kate Diaz mentally opening up the possibility that as these nightmares continue and what seems her connection to the locust and swarm grows it could end up in her continuing the legacy of her ancestors that was left behind before her being that it is taking up the fight against all of humanity. As we saw throughout Gears 3, Queen and Mira really held a huge hatred against all of human life on Sarah, holding the Locust as a true species above everything else. It's very possible that those same beliefs could trickle down the family tree as Mira's descendant Kate Diaz learns and begins to understand what is really going on and why her family is just so heavily connected to the past and present enemy, with it already being confirmed that Kate Diaz will be exploring planet Sarah in Gears 5, looking for the answers to the Locust origins. The or Origins of the Locust and a Queen Mirror have never been just straight out explored or explained in a Gears game with past Epic Game developers showing that it's more of a puzzle with pieces just scattered across all of the games, books and older comics so the Carson Studio could very well be creating their own version of the Locust Origins however it's also possible that an older Gears community member known as Juvius, his theory could get some sort of confirmation which would explain to us why maybe K might actually feel like turning to the wrong side. The Locust and Mirror Origins explain Explained. In short, according to Juvius, is that the original miners mining the emulsion for the COG government began to develop early stages of rustling the emulsion as sickness disease, and so were rounded up by the COG government in secret as they were experimented on by the COG scientists at the New Hope facility to try and find a cure to mutations and effects the emulsion causes. As the miners mutated into the size being the result of humans infected with lambency during the early years of the Pendulum Wars, the children of the miners now turned sires, were actually born with lambency in their DNA cells and as they matured as human adults so did the lambent infection within their genes causing the children to mutate, not in a way like the sires like their fathers, the miners, but in a different way to become the actual locust with the scientists learning a lot about the similarities and differences between humans and the locust creatures with how emotion just affects the DNA on a cellular level. As the COG government was fearing what was happening at New Hope facility, they quietly shut it down moving all of these scientists, staff and subjects to Mount Kadar to be hidden and buried away from the rest of the world which I think is where the scientists just took control and charge in leading this brand new breed of locust species with the knowledge on how to create more of them as well as most likely feeling a lot of emotions for virtually just being forced to live underground by your own government. Mira is believed to be a descendant of those New Hope scientists allowing her to inherit the knowledge of the process to be creating more locust drones giving her the throne and role as queen of the Locust Horde, as well as also Mira just being born and raised deep under the surface, explaining maybe why she just considers herself a Locust and not a human, even though she is one, and feels such a massive vengeance against humanity for forcing the inhabitants of New Hope to live in the Hollow. With the idea of the scientists and their Teb subjects being the Locusts being forced underground by the COG government during the Pendulum Wars, it could actually be the origins Kate maybe uncovers, which she would then be able to relate to in her own life, obviously being born and raised as an as an outsider in the wild lands of Sarah outside of the new COG order government during the current Gears games and the exact reason why maybe she might feel like following in pursuit of taking her place as the new Locust Queen. Please make sure to leave me a comment down below telling me what you think. Do you believe that, that after discovering the origins and its truths that Kate Diaz will become a little bit evil and take her rightful family place as the next new Locust Queen in Gears of War 5? Let me know. So there you have it guys, my full speculation and discussion discussion on the possibility of Kate Diaz turning evil and becoming the fearful new Locust Queen in a Gears of War 5. Give the video a thumbs up and share if you enjoyed it, subscribe if you aren't already. Thank you for watching and as always I shall see you in the next one.